Hello everybody, it is Warhound here, and welcome back to Prison Architect here. We're starting off the episode with something pretty exciting. We are getting our first death row inmate. So, uh, let's do a little reading up on him, if we can find which one he is. We'll have to wait. I don't know what this is. This guy did not come prepared. Right, we'll wait, we'll wait till he's over in this facility over here. But, uh, anyways, guys, uh, did a little work off camera here, and I figured out what the problem was with why we couldn't schedule it. It's because of our regime, there has to be a certain, uh, a certain length of work time that they have to be able to have to be able to take these classes. So now every single class is scheduled, which is why we had a significant drop in money. What is your problem? One prisoner. Alright, well, we'll just change the intake down one then. Alright. Oh wait, no, we should probably turn it down a We can only hold 220. Um, what is your issue? Danger level's high. Um, needs, what do you need? Safety, food, family, and recreation. You have all of those, so stop complaining. What is our a calming effect? Very nice. Yeah, we only had two punishments. Uh, how are you doing, sir? Do you need recruit? Ah. Um. No, this is gonna take too long. Logistics. Uh, no. Uh, intelligence. None of you are confidential informants. Really? All right then. Yep, a lot of tools can come from there. Oh, well, that's that's apparently where they get all the stuff from. Um. Okay, here we go. Here is uh, Nash. Sentenced to 119 years for multiple crimes including murder, torture, and murder. As a wife, two sons, a mother, and a father, as uh, most people do. So, murder for 25 years, pleaded not guilty. Um, torture, pleaded not guilty, not guilty, not guilty, not guilty, and not guilty. Um, so, his mood is normal. Oh, that's good. So likelihood, um, so the likelihood that the uh, appeals board will grant cl clemency and commute the prisoner to death row sentence. Each unsuccessful appeal lowers the value until it is the stake of it. Okay, yada yada yada. Scheduling for the execution before this point will result in extreme penalties if it is later found that the prisoner's appeal would have been succeeded. Um, is granted, immediately released, um, uh, found innocent, transferred to a maximum security prison if the, if judged as guilty. So, it's at 50-50, I'm not going to take that chance, I'm going to wait for it to go far, far down, or until I'm told, go ahead and kill him. But, uh, before that, because someone's in this facility now, that is going on. Um, uh, what did I do off camera? That was, that was pretty much it. Um, I was just working, and then I saw, oh, he's coming in now. So I was like, oh boy. So uh, let's actually, uh, let's check out our grading here. 14, 14% uh, will reoffend, Right? That's what I'm reading. Mm -hmm. So we have an 18 prisoners escape. Um, the wall is not worth it. Um, and we drop. Why do we drop? Why do we drop? Erg. Oh, someone was just released, I'm assuming, because they just ran away. Okay. Oh, was a teacher. A teacher just came. I missed the class. What are you doing? Um. What else was I looking at? Uh, uh let's actually look at, uh, we can shell, sell shares, which is plenty of money, um. Recent escapes, yep. Okay, well, um, starting grant. Apparently, I have a grant. I own 100% of my prison. I tend to do that. Um, let's see, what is causing us the most money? Guard wages, that is what. Um, but I mean, eventually, we'll need our, all those guards, so you know. Um, we got. Maybe a little more money coming in for prisoners, that'd be nice. Uh, grants. 
What? Oh, that that thing's stupid. I hate that one. Five hundred is our next goal here. Or, um, yep. Oh, we are offering that, and we are also offering that as well. So that's just waiting now. Um, escape attempt is slowly going up. Um, you know, as always, bringing it up every day. You know. Every time someone escapes, it skyrockets up. And when people get caught, oh boy, do they get mad. Um, regime is still looking good. Needs is mostly stupid stuff. Um, like how I can hear. I can see what the what the prisoners are supposed to do. Um, intake, we're currently going to bring in three people, which should be our capacity, right? Why are we still over? Uh, two prisoners. Not to be able to be signed to SL. So then, I guess we're just gonna take two people off of that. Um, I don't know why they're not assigned to SL. We have 216 of these guys in here. And staff, a lot of guards. Um, and uh, that's what I like to hire a lot of guards because then they can take breaks uh, more often here. Shoot, I never checked. Does this. Oh. It just doesn't work. Alright. I just, uh, last episode, I think before last episode, I did it so it would just turn on and off, and now it's back on, but it never did that. Okay, so, where are the two people that are not, yep, they're sleeping in here tonight, um, which is why we have this room here, is so they'll sleep there if needed to be sleeping in there. Um, what was the plan for today's episode? No clue. Uh, let me actually just add a little more security right to this, uh, area right here. And know me and my security, you know. Um, oh yeah, last episode, this area was all done here. Should I, I should have marked that shower, that might be helpful. Um, remark that shower, you know. Uh, showers. Well, put that back in a shower, you know. There we go. Um, yeah, um, not much to do, uh, not much added here. Um, actually, I'm going to add some sprinkler systems into the uh, kitchen here. Um, that might be useful in the future, you never know. Something might start fire in the kitchen, because that's normally sometimes where most fires actually happen. Um, and then let's just get uh, pipes running through this entire room here, because... You know, we've got electrical wires going running through this entire room as well, so why not have water pipes running through this entire room as well? That makes perfect logical sense, doesn't it? And then we'll just run this pipe back all the way up to here, and run it back all the way up to here, and run it back all the way up to here, and skip over this, and back up to that pipe right there. There we go. Totally unnecessary, but I did it. So now we're making uh, plenty of money here, 4,000 a day, let's try and keep it there, um, that'd be nice. I have to figure out what I want to put here, um, and how much rooms, um, uh, I've been lo like, I just look through the room list and I try to see what would be nice to put there, you know, uh, I actually, I'm thinking about doing a shop, um, because there's not a shop down here, there's just a shop up here. Um, actually, I'm just gonna try and wait. Uh, I'm gonna wait until there's a, until there's work on the regime, which I do believe they get right to work. Um, no oh, free time when they wake up, and then they eat, and then they're working. You know, not that mean of a guy. Um, so let's actually get this brick wall coming up here. No, 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 cancel that. All right, let's do it over here and go all the way down here, too wide. And like that, skip one for the entrance for the employees or whatever. And then obviously we're gonna have to get a shop window, shop front. We'll put one there, and then we'll put one waiting. We'll put one on the opposite side. Um, I would like to put one right here. Um, these are nice because sometimes prisoners will not be well fed and then they will complain. But uh, now they won't complain because they can buy food actually, um, which will be nice. Um, let's actually uh, shop. Uh, let's actually uh, zone this as a shop. Um, 
Where is shop? Shop, shop, shop. Uh, I saw it earlier. Shop, there we go. Alright, and so this is the shop. It's not gonna be big enough. Nope, alright. Completely cancel all this. Alright. Uh, let's actually just take out the wall and make it 4x4. Four four. We're gonna totally forget about this section right here. Um, so. Demolish this wall complete. Uh, no, 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 no. Demolish this wall right there. And then we'll just add up to there. Add up to there. And shut. Nope. That'll be the entrance, actually. That's what we can use it as the entrance. Um. And then we'll have to actually, uh. Yep. Take care of that. Oh, for me. Thank you, guys. Dismantle that. <clears throat> and then we get two doors. There we go. I think that'll work out fine for shop. Uh, let's zone this now, or zone it. Uh, whatever. Whatever. Um, get another shop front. Nope. Front shop front right there, and shop front right there, and split this one and. No, no. Skip two. No, skip three. Ah, uh, there's no good spot to put it. We'll just put two right next to each other there. And then we'll get plenty of shop shelves for all their storage needs, you know. Uh, don't I need a table? Yeah, I need a table as well. Well, that's just great. Didn't plan for that. Uh, let's cancel that one. Put a put a table right there. I think this one's going to be bigger than this one. Yep, this one just has two shelves and a table. Oh, we might want to put more tables in here. Er, I don't know how I want to do this. Uh, I'm probably to put a table the long way here. Yeah, there you go. There we go. That'll work out just fine. Now we'll prioritize this table. There we go, and that'll be the shop entrance right there, and there's no wall right there, there should be a wall right there that looks a little funky. Let's prioritize this actually. I like how they walk through the bathroom to get here. Alright, sweet, so they're already loading stuff in, um, we'll get some workers to logistics. Five guys coming in here. Actually, work time now, I want to check out, has anybody, nope, nobody has passed this course so they can't work here. Uh, not everybody's working in there, not everybody. No, nobody works in laundry, apparently. They're working in this laundry. They're working in this kitchen, they're working in the shop. So, I mean, we're getting plenty of stuff done in this prison by prison labor. Which is, uh, amazing. Uh, let's go into intelligence here. Performance, potential CI. Let's, uh, go ahead and recruit him. Nope, you. You, sir. We recruit you. You. Recruit you. If I recruit them, don't they get. Yep, they're out once I recruit them. You're a snitch. Um, I don't know. I'm just. I'm trying to decide in my head real quick. Um, if I want to do protective custody or not. Uh, I'll just check you manually. Um, nope. Let me actually see. Who has the best coverage of all my CE? This guy has a hundred percent. Where's he going, man? Okay, so this guy has a hundred percent. Uh, yep, snitch. Oh, yep, he's going all the way up here. Well, ah, don't question it. All right. Yeah, a lot of snitches in this prison, uh, that's why they're probably minimum. Got a skilled fighter just sitting down here. Um. Uh oh. These guys are all targets. Uh oh. So I'm thinking about building a protective custody wing. That might be, that might be tomorrow's episode. Um, or not tomorrow's, next time's, next episodes. Um, so yep, here we go. Mm -hmm. Still nobody working in the library. 
kind of sad. One day, um, how many prisoners have taken the course is the real question. Um, there are 15 interested, none have taken it, and none have taken that. Uh, Alright, so it'll be a while before anybody, you know, actually gets it. Uh, salt, wait, why are you in solitary again? Uh, found drugs, great. We need just more drugs in this prison, don't we? Let's look at the different, uh, last 24 hours. Uh, main source of stuff has been coming in from here. Um. Drill. You are the owner. Now you're in jail. Alright. Stolen from it. was hidden there. Yeah, everything gets smuggled in from here, so I'm actually thinking about putting a guard dog. Um, we're actually gonna stay. Nope, there's already a guard dog stationed in here. So it sounds like we're going to need another one because apparently people don't really listen. We've already got a bunch of guard dogs. Sniffer dogs, guard dogs, whatever you want to call them. Patrolling this little area here. Um, so I don't know why they're still getting smuggled in. The dogs should catch them. How many dogs do we have patrolling out here, actually? That is the real question. Uh, no, guard patrols. We just have two. No. Uh, dog patrols, that's what I want. Yeah, I don't think I can... How many... My dogs do Yep, they're all sleeping. Yep. Okay, um... Yeah, um, we're gonna do protective custody next episode. This is kind of just a cleaning up episode. Um, how are you doing? 48%. Don't think I'm gonna schedule it just yet. Um... Uh, yep. Is it a bad moon? Oh, great. No, you're about to die, so I, I don't see why I can't reward you. N not reward you. Um, I don't know why I can't, you know, let, uh, give you some stuff. Uh, TV. Let's get a nice, large TV. Large TV. You know? Get some radios. Make your final call, you know? What else do we need? Uh, let's actually put some metal detectors right there. No, what the heck, we'll give you some windows so you can see outside. To the fence that I built. <laughs> yeah. That's what I do, I build fences. We can even leave you a j I won't put... No intimidation factor. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Why don't my guards stop them? Because they dug to the one spot, I don't have guards. Great. Alright, um... Obviously we're gonna have to put some guard tower. There's a guard tower right there. And right there. Guess what? One's going right next to the hole now. <sighs> it's all these people digging out of this stupid prison. Uh, it's the only thing. It's just people digging out. Um... Yeah, so now we're adding in windows. Windows are always nice. Uh oh. Please don't say you're gonna get stuck, I swear to god. Okay, they can crawl through the wall. Good to know. Um, yeah, we got them a little window right there. I had a little common room, you know. A lot of common room right in here. Uh common room, there we go. Another Oh no, that, that was already there. Oh, that's right. Uh, obviously, you know what this means, you guys. Shut down. Hey, if I got problems, we're gonna have to do shut down. And then, obviously, because he has escaped now. Uh, Alright, why are you always on lockdown? Oh, I forget, they're always on lockdown. Yeah, you can't actually change it. They're stuck in. Yeah. Well, even if I added a common room, too late. Uh, we can dismantle all these then.
you know what? Actually, because I'm a nice, nice uh, designer here, what we shall do is uh, each cell will come with a radio, a phone, and of course, a TV. But because I'm poor, this prison is very poor. If you have not noticed, we can only give you one TV. I mean, a tiny TV, not a big TV. Big TV, too much. Yep. Hey, but we give you phone booth because we feel bad you can't leave. Um, kind of want to allow you to leave, but apparently you can't. Here's a radio, and we'll also give you a bookshelf too because we're nice. Um, bookshelf. That's what I want. We can also add one more thing. What shall we add? A pool table. No. Um. Hmm. <laughs> oh, yeah, I should probably be placing these. <coughs> mm-hmm. In the cafeterias. All my guards are currently being used for. Who knows what, actually. Uh, let's put a garbage can there, 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 there. I kind of screwed up on the design of this canteen. Forgot to leave a space. Erg. Whoopsies. And then we'll continue adding trash cans in this canteen here. Like, uh, this. Let's just hope it motivates people to throw things away. Especially, apparently, our own cooks. Might help them. We'll have to put the one in this kitchen as well. There we go, that should help out a little bit. Um, and then we'll put some in the garbage area as well. Because, I mean, it is a garbage area. Okay, do they got all this stuff installed now? Yeah. He's relaxing. I mean, I don't know why he's bad, you know. Look at all this cool stuff I'm giving you. And I haven't even connected your phone line. I mean, this would be a great time. When I connect you to you. And then go connect this guy all the way up to his own private phone and tap the thing. Oh yeah, and all connected. All right, sweet. That's the cheap way to do it. All right. Look, they even serve him food. How nice. Let's see. Uh, prison cell rating. Uh, um. Ooh. Where do I see that? Uh, planning emergencies, not emergencies. Um, room quality, two out of six. What? It is kind of small. Um. Yeah. Mm, I need. I did give him an outdoor window. I mean, I'm I'm a very generous person. I mean, you cannot be that mad. I mean, for a death row cell, this is not very bad. Jesus, are you guys really stuck? I will add a door. I will have to add a door. I can't believe I have to say this. I will have to add a door. My lord. Alright. So, staff room, that's looking nice. Alright. So, I think 
uh, that's pretty much it for cleaning up today. Let's do another shakedown because I am paranoid. Um, but either way, I think we're gonna have to end off today's episode here, guys. So thank you guys for watching today's episode. If you guys did enjoy, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Um, so you get updates every time I start doing a video. Um, but thank you guys for watching today's episode. I hope you guys did enjoy it. And if you did, don't forget to leave a like. And I'll see you guys next time. Have a great day. Peace out.